It's often been said that presentation is everything. Well, if that's true, then just imagine how important offering constructive feedback is for that presentation. Hello, and welcome to our process on the importance of giving effective speech evaluations. My name is Bob Terrell, and after joining Toastmasters, I remember being impressed by the fact that whatever our role was, speaker or leader, we would have the opportunity to improve through feedback. Toastmasters value feedback from their first day in a club environment, and that club environment is a place we can get and give specific and constructive feedback on any presentation. This is all about the importance of effective feedback and what we can do to make sure it is effective. In our time together, you'll see what techniques can make the evaluation most effective. And finally, you will be offered suggestions on how to create and then deliver the most effective evaluation consistently. Are the speeches, um, the evaluations only for the, the speaker or is it presented to the rest of Because what happens in our club is the, the speaker will stand up and the communication is between the evaluator and the speaker and what about the rest of us? Yeah, good question. There have been a lot of people that say two ways. They make the speaker stand up, which to me is very uncomfortable. They end up standing like this, going, okay, yeah, all right. Can't let me sit down and drink my coffee, please. You can still talk to me. And the point is, just as I'm trying to do in this workshop, I, you asked the question. My main comments are coming back to you, but it doesn't stop me from looking at you. It doesn't stop me from answering to the main audience. So here's what I'm going to say. It's my opinion only. I say speak to her, your target speaker, most of the time. And then if you want to say, but wasn't it great? Did you see the way she worked the stage? Wasn't it? I mean, it's like saying, we're applauding you, even though I'm kind of applauding you specifically. But the main part, I speak right to my target speaker. Because just like we're doing now, I want you to know how I feel through these. And trust me, I'd never say, stand there like this, or like this, or like this. I mean, after a while, it's nerve-wracking. I can't imagine clubs that do that. But, but many do, and they say, oh, no. In fact, one person made me do it in a contest. Can you imagine that? A target, they, they made me get up, and you have to stand up. I went, okay, whatever you say, pal. It just, it was crazy. I felt crazy. But I, I'm just suggesting, talk to her most of the time, bring the audience in when you want to make a major applause, and don't, once again, go back to your club and say, can we, can we revisit this? Can we think of something different than making the person stand up? That's tough.